Hey there, fellow Roblox travelers. Today, we've got a game-changing tutorial for all you Empire Clash players out there. If you're tired of being a broke farmer and want to rise from farmer to king while raising money, stick around, because we're going to spread the secrets of how to make money fast in this totally serious guide on how to transition from poor farmer to rich king in the game. Let's get started. All right, buckle up for step one in our epic quest for Roblox riches. First off, search for an empty server from the list. Join it so that we can become the king of our faction. Being king has its perks. Make sure to enact the mining edict to boost your loot gains. You can activate the edict by going to the crown menu by pressing P key on your keyboard, then going to the politics menu and then view edicts and enact the encourage mining edict from the list. Step two, acquiring the right tools. Now let's gear up for success. Navigate to the tools shop Locate the pickaxe section and grab yourself a gold pickaxe. It's the ideal choice, but if you're on a budget, a steel pickaxe will do the job just fine. I mean, it's all right, like... Purchase it, and you're ready to start your mining adventure. Step 3. Scouting for Mines Time to put that shiny new pickaxe to use. Open up your map by pressing M key on the keyboard and look for mines near your location and head there to mine. Remember, the more valuable the resource, the better the profit. While gold may be the most expensive, it comes in lesser quantity. Iron, on the other hand, goes for a good price and is abundant. Pay attention, peasants. Your inventory is your treasure chest. The maximum limit for an item is 200. So if you got max of item like iron, just go back once and sell so you don't waste time mining without actually getting the item. A little longer than a few minutes later. Step 5. Strategic Selling Now, when it's time to sell, don't just rush to any shop. Sell strategically to get the best prices. Now, here's the real secret to maximizing profits. Check the shop's inventory first. For coal and iron, make sure there are less than 30 in the shop. And for gold, it should be less than 10. Just sell that much quantity, which make the inventory of the shop to 30 for iron and coal, and for gold, it's 10. So you make out the max profit of your mining trip.
Step 6. Server Hopping for Profit A common mistake is selling everything in one shop or in one server only. Once the shop inventory is full, I recommend server hopping to find an empty shop in a different server and sell your goods again. If you change server, the remaining items stay in your inventory. This technique ensures you get the most out of your hard-earned resources. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> Another one. And there you have it, fellow Empire Clash enthusiasts, the ultimate money-making guide for peasant class. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe for more pro tips, and share your own money-making strategies in the comments. Also let me know on which class you want a money-making guide next. Until next time, 